Hello, hello, and welcome back to the show. We have a so beautiful fire happening in the my city, right? It's everything burning, beautiful, nice. Uh, so yeah, we are in the city skylines. I have uh, almost fifty thousand people living in this um, very tiny city, let's say, and uh, I try to solve the traffic problems. Um, but I don't know, I deleted some metro lanes, but as you can see, it's still disaster here. Uh, the trains are still getting stuck on each other. It's kind of moving, but yeah. But on positive note, I managed to make a thousand more uh, passengers per week by deleting some lines, because at least sometimes the trains are moving. And this is very good, I guess. I mean, it would be worse, right? So yeah, that's what I did. And uh, yeah, traffic-wise, uh, yeah. But who cares about cars, right? In the cities, in the reality, I build another bridge for them to cross. So in this part is not that bad. As you can see, it's uh, a bit uh, clogged, uh, but it could be a thousand times worse, but the views are awesome here. So, here is my entrance and exit, of course, pay for that. And uh, yeah, this is the basically city, my doomsday, uh, let's say, electricity and water supply is very, a lot of eating money from the budget. Uh, but, uh, you know, step by step could be a thousand times worse. And yes, I like always apologizing for bird noise. Uh, they are always noisy when I'm recording videos. Uh, they want just to speak. So yeah, uh, maybe I need to make another episode of destroying the city. This time for real. Um, if you want to see that, let me know, because... As you can see, everything is bad here. Like, not even growing money a lot. Uh, the traffic is terrible. Uh, people, are, basically money-wise, is terrible. And everything is bad. And uh, this thing is not working how I wanted it to work. So basically all shit is not making enough uh, money and electricity and power to make it a valuable option. So... Yeah, it's enough for this itself because this is uh, all. Uh, all this uh, hydro plant is feeding uh, only this part, I think. Let's see if I'm right. Yep, I am. So basically, this is only fed by this. So could be worse, I guess, right? So yeah, uh, what else to say? Uh, basically, here is insanity pollution. I have. Uh, as much as possible trains traffic is always a problem but i tried my metro uh, thing to fix but eh, it didn't work like always so uh, if you have any solutions i mean opinions or ideas how to fix this uh, city to make it even uh, better for everyone to live here because we want right everyone to live here right right uh let me know in the comments below i am gonna read uh, each of the comment because i'm kind of motivated to finally fix the city right so now i am building more let's say blocks of people to live uh, they want commercial uh, real estate so let's build them uh, let's make some trees uh, even maybe palms, uh, palms, so they can have a very nice views and they can enjoy whatever will happen. Maybe some fire, you know. You never know. You know, good, good usual stuff. So these palms can uh, break windows. Who cares? Yeah. So let's palm them. And uh, I'm still waiting for one upgrade uh, uh, in this style. Then I can start building the city defenses. 
against uh, tsunamis because now if I just uh, launch a tsunami I'm pretty sure it will come from another side and uh, basically the whole city will be destroyed well you know what uh, let's make this happen let's see what what gonna happen uh, so let's launch uh, one meter uh, strike and uh, maybe two tsunamis because it will cool down a bit so yeah let's see what what gonna happen I'm pretty sure uh, we can launch as much as possible meteorites nothing will bad happen because uh, this is not deep enough water and uh, these defenses uh, should be enough for the uh, for the basically wave to become but for tsunami I'm 100% sure it's not enough oh no it's so bad okay it's coming okay so this this gonna we're gonna see and third tsunami so yeah we will have a three tsunami waves yep 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 oh no how many I launch of them really how much of them I, I I made I think four okay so now let's speed up the time and let's see I am sure that even this is enough or maybe not let's see yeah you see this is more than enough to uh, make like all it will happen basically from this it will be a tiny little bit of uh, uh, of flooding nothing serious uh, however when the tsunami will come that's the whole different story why is always uh, bad things happen i mean good things for video happen when it's dark and it's very difficult to see so yeah all even energy dissipated i can see already it's like look uh, nothing left from this uh, meteorite strike yeah see these defenses are more than enough uh, for the meteorite strike or maybe I'm really uh, strategically uh, positioned all of these defenses yeah you see there will be minor flooding it's okay because this is very low ground near the harbor uh, but uh, there will be absolutely nothing major however now we need to catch up from where the tsunami is coming of course it will come from the some side which is absolutely not protected uh so let's see where is tsunami where are you we missed you still bridges are fine they're lit that means uh the tsunami is not uh make I think I can see it it's probably here so that means it will come again on an unprotected area however this time I can build walls uh, fully so maybe it will help uh, let's build two lines of defense how about this let's be a, a let's say a a clever this right uh, because we never know you know let's be a, a, a you know cautious mayor of the city and uh, think that uh, what if something uh, we need to do uh, defense lines of the tsunami how about even third one or even better like this let's make something like that you know I'm really curious. I never tried like a uh, few different defense lines. I think a real civil engineer uh, on his video uh, tried 
building these kind of defenses and I think uh, they did work a bit. I know I am ruining basically my money because this is the... This part, it's already does have uh, some fears. So, eh, you know what? Yeah, let's make something like that. Yeah. Let's make like the, let's make really something like uh, let's protect the city as much as possible. I know I'm ruining basically, uh, I'm ruining basically the fertile land and stuff, but let's try this. I know we can do this. So this will be a bonus uh, thing. Let's connect all of the lines. You know, it's like this is important. I'm very cautious mayor of the city. Yeah. Will will this will hold? One way to find out. Because tsunami is almost here and uh, To be honest, I'm not seeing that oh water line is retracting as hell. So this is kind of final spectacle before the big tsunami. Uh, don't forget, we're gonna have three of them. So if one uh, will be not penetrating the whole de defense, there might be more of them doing this. So we're gonna see. Okay, so here is the first wave. Of course, this will gonna, without any problems, penetrate the first line of defense. Uh, how about second? Without any questions, second one is penetrated. Uh, it's a bit slowing down. The third one, the last one, is being penetrated without any problems. Look at this. It's like nothing happened. Wow. It's just buying time, to be honest. Yeah, look at this. It's just without any questions. Now the question. Uh, I think, yeah, here is like sucker of the water. So if it will be uh, higher ground, you know what? Uh, as the last defense, uh, line of defense, let's build here some. I know. I know. No, it's not. It's absolutely not realistic uh, that this, this, these kind of things will gonna happen like in real. That you know somebody will stop time when the tsunami is coming. But let's see. Let's save it. Let's try to save the city because don't forget there's third wave is coming. Oh yeah, zero. So our industry will be totally, totally, totally demolished without any questions. Now the question is about holy. Wow. The question is about, yeah, look at this, it's full, it's like... I would say it's holding a bit, but it's too late. It's too late. Now the devastating tsunami is coming. And now the buildings will, will, will start falling. There is a chance that there is a chance even that uh, oh look at this there is fire coming to be honest probably nothing will fall down uh, terribly so the defense did work kind of work and who knows maybe the water will not penetrate the whole city even uh, because the buildings I'm I'm 100% sure they are holding. Okay, the second wave is coming. Now it should wash up everything. Uh, this is expected that everything will, will basically go to hell. Now the question is uh, if the residential buildings will fall or not. I think it will because now it's very high up. The huge wave. Is coming so the f let's see the first buildings yep they starting to fall oh I didn't see in this part there is still dry parts of the city 
Uh, not for long, I know. Oh, look at this. The cars is even flowing. Um, I think the buildings will hold in the residential part. But everything will be washed. Yep. I think there is no more dry spot in the city. Everything is flooded. Look at this. Even this. And we still producing electricity. Cool. So our doomsday. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, even game is lagging. So basically, after tsunami, um, uh, nothing left. Yeah. And this is, I think, crisis. Yes, crisis response uh, unit. That is dead. Okay. So the answer is that the city is not capable holding up. Even with million of um, defense lines. And as you can see, everything is dead. There is crime happening. There is absolutely no work. And we're losing money as uh, basically leaves on the fall. Anyhow, so that was fun to me. I did enjoy this. If you did too, don't forget to click a like, so subscribe and share buttons. Because this is how you're gonna shove the support of this channel. And uh, because this woman is annoying, I guess I will finish this episode here. Thank you for watching. And with everyone else, see you in the next one.